The College of Biological Sciences (CBS) is one of 7 freshman admitting colleges at the University of Minnesota. Established in 1869 as the College of Sciences, the College of Biological Sciences is now located on both the Minneapolis campus and the St. Paul campus. CBS is a college that focuses its undergraduate and graduate attention towards research. The dean is Valerie E. Forbes. The Associate Dean for Graduate Education is Carrie Wilmot, the Associate Dean for Undergraduate Education is John Ward, the Associate Dean for Research is Thomas Hayes, and the Associate Dean for Faculty is Marlene Zuck. Institution The College of Biological Sciences at the University of Minnesota is one of the few colleges nationwide devoted to biological sciences. CBS explores a world of opportunities, from molecules to ecosystems, to improve human health, develop renewable resources, enhance agriculture, and restore the environment. College of Biological Science undergraduates are among the most qualified at the University of Minnesota. The 2008 incoming freshman class, on average, had the highest class rank and ACT scores of any college within the university system. There were 1,789 undergraduates registered for fall 2006 and 82% graduated in the top 15% of their high school class. There were a total of 377 freshmen and 135 faculty members many of which are known for their excellence with four of them being in the National Academy of Sciences. CBS faculty conduct basic research on a range of applications in human health, agriculture, biotechnology and environmental sciences. Topic history In 1887, the Animal Science Department was established in the College of Science, Letters, and Arts. In 1927, it was renamed Zoology. Then in 1891, the Botany Department was created. Eight years later, Lake Itasca Forestry and Biological Station was established with a forestry training program. It is now the site for the Nature of Life program CBS students must attend for three days in the summer before their freshman year. Then the Agricultural Biochemistry Department was formed within the Institute of Agriculture. In 1928, Snyder Hall, named for agricultural scientist Harry Snyder, was built to house agricultural biochemistry. Snyder Hall is now headquarters for CBS located on the St. Paul campus. Northrop Auditorium was built only a year later. In 1973, the Biological Sciences Center was built to house the Botany Department and the Genetics and Cell Biology Department. In 1993, the Ecology Building was constructed on the St. Paul campus. Two years later, administration of the Bell Museum was transferred to the College of Natural Resources. Then in 1998, Dean Robert Eld led a university-wide reorganization to consolidate and realign departments in order to strengthen biological sciences and raise the university's national standing. 
The College of Biological Sciences (CBS) current structure grew out of that effort. In 2001, Biodale opened, offering biological research support services to faculty, students, and industry. It is currently one of the most used resource on campus. Then in 2004, University Enterprise Laboratories, Inc. was dedicated. Founding sponsors included Xcel Energy, the City of St. Paul, the University of Minnesota, 3M Medtronic, Dorsey & Whitney, Sermotics, Guidant, Boston Scientific, and Ecolab. Topic Structures Administrative offices for the College of Biological Sciences are located in Snyder Hall, at 1475 Gortner Avenue on the Street, Paul Campus. These include the Dean's Office, Communications, and Alumni Relations. Student services are located in the Molecular Cellular Biology Building at 420 Washington Avenue, southeast on the East Bank campus. Plant biology, microbial biochemistry, and ecology, evolution and behavior are in adjacent buildings. The Cargill Building for Microbial and Plant Genomics is across the street. The Department of Biochemistry, Molecular Biology and Biophysics and the Department of Genetics, Cell Biology, and Development are in the Molecular and Cellular Biology Building on the Minneapolis campus the Department of Biochemistry, Molecular Biology and Biophysics and the Department of Genetics, Cell Biology and Development are shared with the University of Minnesota Medical School. The Department of Plant Biology is shared with the College of Food, Agricultural and Natural Resource Sciences the Department of Ecology, Evolution and Behavior remains exclusive to CBS with close ties to CFANS, which administers the Bell Museum of Natural History. The Department of Neuroscience and the Department of Microbiology — both part of the medical school — are affiliated with CBS. The Biotechnology Institute is a joint effort of CBS and the Institute of Technology. CBS also operates two field stations — Cedar Creek Natural History Area, the birthplace of the modern science of ecosystem ecology, and Itasca Biological Station and Laboratories used for education programs, field research and public outreach. Topic research facilities and fields The College of Biological Sciences shares several research, education and outreach facilities. Biodale, CBS one-stop shop for research support services, houses $40 million in bioscience research equipment that is available to faculty and industry scientists. The Cargill Building for Microbial and Plant Genomics provides a hub for genomics researchers university-wide. Faculty conduct basic research in functional genomics of microbes and crop plants to identify innovative ways to make crops more resistant to disease and drought, clean up the environment, and improve human health. The Molecular and Cellular Biology Building opened in 2002 on the Minneapolis campus and houses classrooms and labs. It is home to the Department of Biochemistry, Molecular Biology, and Biophysics and the Department of Genetics, Cell Biology, and Development. 
University Enterprise Laboratories UEL, is a non-profit entity that provides lab space for biotech startup companies. Sponsors include Xcel Energy, 3M, Alina, Medtronic, Boston Scientific, Dorsey and Whitney, Ecolab, Guidant Corporation, and Sermotics. Itasca Biological Station and Laboratories established in 1909, houses many buildings for research as well as the summer portion of the freshman program, Nature of Life which all incoming CBS freshmen must attend before entering their first year at the university. This portion of Nature of Life prepares students for the upcoming year and gives them an idea of one of the research facilities provided by CBS and the university. The program continues for the next four semesters, during which each enrolled CBS freshman is expected to fully immerse themselves into CBS and university wide events and communities. Other research facilities include Cedar Creek Ecosystem Science Reserve, the Ecology Building, Plant Growth Facilities, and Snyder Hall, Gortner Laboratories, Biological Sciences. Center complex. Topic Notable faculty and staff. In 1995, Edward B. Lewis BS39 received the Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine for discovery of the collinearity principle in fruit flies, which revealed that the linear arrangement of genes on a chromosome corresponds to the development of body segments. The finding was later confirmed in humans. Then in 1997, Paul D. Boyer won the Nobel Prize in Chemistry for discovering how cells make adenosine triphosphate ATP. Boyer was on the faculty of the Biochemistry Department from 1945 to 1957. G. David Tillman is the current director of Cedar Creek Ecosystem Science Reserve and member of the National Academy of Sciences. He is currently the most cited ecologist in the web of science. <laughs> Majors offered Biochemistry BIOC Biology Bio Ecology Evolution and Behavior EEB Genetics Cell Biology and Development GCD Microbiology MICB Neuroscience NSC Plant Biology PBIO Topic Minors Biochemistry Biology Plant Biology Marine Biology Microbiology Neuroscience Pharmacology Topic Graduate programs Biochemistry, Molecular Biology, and Biophysics BMBB Ecology, Evolution and Behavior EEB Molecular, Cellular, Developmental Biology, and Genetics MCDBNG Plant Biological Sciences Topic Research Projects In addition to the Nobel Prize winners for physiology and biochemistry, other important research projects have been conducted by the university and CBS. 
Being a research-based college, faculty and students often take advantage of plentiful opportunities to research a variety of topics. MCD BNG Faculty Research BMBB Faculty Research EEB Faculty Research Topic Grants Funding is needed for all projects one recently was the $2.8 million grant from the National Science Foundation which supported interdisciplinary training for ecologists and civil engineers. This grant was used to train graduate students in ecology, civil engineering, and geology to study the combined effects of physical and biological changes on environmental quality, in particular the Mississippi River watershed. Another grant was the $8.5 million grant from the Initiative for Renewable Energy and the Environment. Projects included bioenergy and bio products, economic and policy assessments, production and distribution of hydrogen, carbon sequestration, nanotechnology, solar thermal heating systems, and conversion of livestock waste to energy and products. They awarded this grant to 24 renewable energy projects at the university in August 2006, including CBS. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Student involvement. CBS students are not only heavily involved with their classes, but also in many different student organizations related to the biological sciences. Administrative sponsored student clubs include CBS Student Board CBS Ambassadors Dean's Scholars Program CBS Circles University of Minnesota students also have the opportunity to create their own student groups. Examples of these student started groups include AED Pre Medical Honor Society, AMSA Pre Med, Biochemistry Club, Biological Science Research Club Biology Without Borders Brain Club Ecology, Evolution, and Behavior Club Forensic Science Club Future Leaders Aspiring in Science and Healthcare Genetics, Cell Biology, and Development Club Health and Biological Research News Club Interprofessional Pre-Health Students Marine Biology Club Microbiology Club Microbiota in Health and Medicine Interest Group Minnesota Medical Leaders Minority Association of Pre-Medical Students MSTEM Pharmacology Club Pre-Dental Club Pre-Genetic Counseling Club Pre-Meds in Action Pre-Occupational Therapy Group Pre-Optometry Club Pre-Pharmacy Club Pre-Physical Therapy Club Pre-Physician Assistant Organization Pre-Veterinary Club Student Society of Stem Cell Research Club Synthetic Biology Society Undergraduate Public Health Association Undergraduate Surgery Interest Group Footnotes <laughs> 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 
Topic See also University of Minnesota List of University of Minnesota people University of Minnesota Medical Center <laughs>